am making instant pot greens. This is not my normal greens recipe um, because I'm making it in the instant pot. However, I have two bunches in my pot <clears throat> and um, I'm making these quickly because I have to be somewhere in a little while. So here we go. So once your greens have been cleaned and cut, you go ahead and just drop them in the pot. So now I have in my turkey leg, I just so happen to find one where the bottom is cut off. However, if you come across one that's not, if you just shave some of this off the top, drop it in a pot, it should be short enough to fit um, upward in your pot. So now I am going to add some onion. So if you guys check out my gadgets that I posted a couple years ago, this is my chopper and because I only made half the recipe because if you look at the blog it actually is for four bunches of greens it calls for a whole medium onion because I'm only doing two bunches of greens I'm not putting the whole onion I'm gonna put half of it in there and then I'll save the other half in a little bit that so then next we're gonna go ahead and put in some minced garlic that much garlic that works eh, maybe a little bit more <clears throat> so instead of one fourth cup of vinegar we're just gonna go ahead and sprinkle in an eighth of a cup because we have less um, greens Okay, so next I'm going to put in some chicken broth. Alright, so I have just two cans of chicken broth and my smoked turkey leg of course is already cooked just for anyone who didn't know that. So each one of these is 32 ounces. And I'm actually going to need to add water because this is not going to be enough. Ooh, I think I'm going to sneeze. Oh, maybe not. So we have some sea salt here, which I actually prefer to have in there but it, it will fall off the turkey meat a little black pepper and some crushed red pepper So now I am actually going to add a few cups of water and this is going to be eyeballed. So this is two cups of water. And I think, well, let's see. So I'm at my max line for the most part on this. So. There we go. That's good enough. And just because I'm going to add a little bit of chicken bouillon. So this is what it's looking like right now. All of this is going to be one delicious pot of greens in half the time. Yay. So my pot is in the closed locked position. It is in the ceiling position. So I am going to do manual 
which is pressure cook for 60 minutes. Jeez. All right, so we're gonna cook this for one hour. You guys, I wanted to show you guys something. So there's a lot of water in here. So I put this in about, I think I turned this on about one, no, 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 sorry. 12, it's now 202. As you can see, it took a long time to come to pressure because there was a lot of water and uh, it's just now starting its countdown. It's eight minutes into its countdown. So it took almost an hour, well, no, about an hour just to come to pressure, but it is there. I am going to let this go ahead in natural release and I am going to go ahead and go where I had planned on going because I'm a little late. So this is going to natural release on its own. The greens will continue to cook and then after that it will go into warm mode and I will come back home and uh, cook the second part of my meal and there will be a video for that as well. So as you can see, I've been away for a minute. It is now three hours and 23 minutes in warm mode. It natural released on its own, no more steam. So let's go ahead and open the pot. Ooh, yes. But this definitely has to be stirred. Ooh, yes. Look at that meat. Look at that. <laughs> it's off that bone. Look at that. Let me stir it all in there, make sure it's all. I definitely have to do a taste test, see how we're doing it. Okay, I had to get a fork. Um, I had some dental work done today, so honestly, I can't really even chew this. Mmm, oh. These are really good. I mean, like, really, really, really good. Take a look at that. Let's take a look at this meat. They're very, very tender. So even though I had the dental work, really didn't have to um, bite anything. But again, it's been warming for about three hours. So check that meat out. What's that turkey, that smoked turkey? Mm, mm-hmm. I barely even have to bite the meat. This definitely turned out absolutely perfect, you guys. 